the son is going through a midlife crisis. A recent European Space Agency study claims that the sun has reached its middle age, estimated to be around 4.57 billion years. Currently, the star is bursting with solar flares, mass ejections and storms. The conclusion comes after analyzing the study released by the space agency's spacecraft. It has helped in mapping the life journey of various stars in the universe. Evaluating this data, scientists found that the glowing star is in its middle age. Currently, it remains healthy, fusing hydrogen into helium. However, scientists calculated that in the future, the hydrogen in the sun's core will run out. And this will trigger changes in its fusion process. It will result in the star uh, lowering and the, it will result in the lowering of its surface temperature and soon it will swell into a red giant star. So when does all of this happen? The sun will reach its maximum temperature at 8 billion years and then it will cool down and increase in size. And from there it will transition into becoming a giant red star. So when does the sun die? That moment is billions of years away, around 10 to 11 billion years away. This is when it becomes a dim white dwarf. If there is one thing that is certain, it is this. We will not be around to witness the deaths of the sun. Humanity has around 1 billion years before we need to move away from the sun. Why? Because the sun is increasing in its brightness every day around 10% every billion years. I know that sounds, uh, that does not sound much, but any substantial increase in brightness will end life on Earth. Our oceans will end up evaporating. The surface will become too hot and humankind will no longer be able to inhabit the planet. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.